Hey everybody, I thought I'd share a quick little video with you tonight and a cute little story. Um, so, and also a friend asked me yesterday what I do for aging skin. And so I thought I would share a few little things that I do and some Christmas presents that I got this year that absolutely blew me away. And you never know when you get somebody a Christmas present if they're gonna like it or not. And I absolutely love everything I got for Christmas, um, but um, just some amazing stuff. So I'm gonna share that with you too. And so one of the things that I got for Christmas, oh, I'm gonna share a little story about my mom here when we're done too. But in case um, you just want me to get right to the meat of some good stuff. Um, one of the things that I got that is like my absolute favorite is and i have not turned my screen around so i need to turn that around sorry about that but you probably won't be able to read this but this is a skin cream and it's spelled l apostrophe capital o c c i t a n e and you guys can comment down below if any of you know um, about this cream anyway it's a cream from france it's just amazing it's all natural ingredients but um, this is the Cream Comfort Light Comforting Cream, and it is absolutely amazing. And I've used a lot of creams, and when you have like that old lady crepey skin stuff, like literally, I don't know if you can even see this, and I've been using it for since Christmas, and it's just amazing. So it just like totally changes the texture of your skin and you can put it on your hands. You know, one thing about your hands is they show your age, right? So um, I'm 52, so you gotta really start thinking about these things when you're younger, if you can. So if you're watching this and you're, you know, in your 20s, 30s, it's really time to start thinking about things. You can actually get this on Amazon or you can order it directly from the company. It's exactly the same price, which is interesting as getting from the company. Um, I like Amazon because of course it's free shipping. And I will put, um, I'll go back and edit and add to the text. I actually loved it so much that I'm selling it in my office. So I have an affiliate link. You can get it in my office or through my affiliate link, but it's gonna be the same price however you do it. But if you wanna give me a little shout out and maybe some credits to get some free product, that'd be cool too. But anyway, absolutely love, love, love this cream. It's absolutely amazing. And like I say, I've been using it for a few days and I feel really good. Um, they also make a hand cream, which I also got for a present. And I'm gonna share some other things besides my presents with you. Um, but this is the hand cream version and it is absolutely amazing. It smells wonderful, I love it. And so, um, you know, you would use this up pretty fast and it's not that expensive. Um, when I went online and ordered, um, like some creams like in the department stores are like $100, even, you know, crazy. I've, I've spent a lot of money on creams and this is under $40. So, and again, I have no stock in the company, but I actually loved it so much. I thought I'm going to sign up and I love affiliate programs. Our Carmel program has an affiliate program too. So a little plug there if you're looking for something to, uh, some way to make extra money. Um, so anyway, so this was when I went and signed up for the little affiliate program. It's free to sign up. They send you this little thing and a bunch of little samples. So I haven't even tried all these little samples yet, but anyway, that would be fun. And I'll let you know how that goes. Um, okay. So another thing that I got for Christmas, um, was this product called milk. I don't know if you've ever used this. You can comment down below if you've used it and you love it. Um, but this is the Milk Hydro, and the cool thing about this is that it is a grip set refresh spray, and so you can put it on under your makeup, and it makes your makeup last longer, um, and then you can also just during the day, you know how your makeup starts to kind of look like it's going away, basically, you know, and it needs a little hydration, basically. You can just spray this. It's like a real fine mist. It's really cool. It feels really good. Um, and again, this is called Milk Hydro. It comes in a box, looks like this. Um, this was a gift, so I don't know where they got that. And I, I haven't looked it up um, yet from my sweet little friend, Michaela. Um, but it actually has hemp in it, which is really cool. Um, cannabinoid, so love that too, right? win-win um and then she also gave me this um milk makeup this is the grip eye primer and um i'm gonna save this for a little story at the end about my mom's ghost so i'm gonna revisit this in just a little bit um and oh uh, while i'm talking about it i'm in my pajamas these are wonderful pajamas my boyfriend got me these pajamas and so i'm doing this nighttime video in my pajamas but they're called cozy earth 
and they are a bamboo. And the thing I love about them is because they're super tall and my pajamas are always too short and then I wash them and then they're too short. And it's not a problem that a lot of people have, but I'm 5'11", so the tall girl stuff is awesome. So pretty cool. Okay, so just a couple other things about skincare and how to take care of your skin. One thing that I absolutely love is Retin-A, and I know I'm flipped around, you can't see this, but I love Retin-A and it's a prescription, so you gotta find a doc who will do that for you, but um, it helps with the fine lines and it helps with the deep open pores. And if you have any kind of hormone imbalances, it's really good. It's a vitamin A derivative, so I'm all about supplements and things like that. And speaking of supplements, I'm jumping around a little bit. This is our private label um, vitamin C, but vitamin C is amazing. I knew a lady one time when I was in my 20s and she was in her 40s, she looked amazing. I said, how do you look so good? And she said, I take four grams of vitamin C every day. So I've been very religious about that. And I also have a vitamin C topical serum. I just ordered this on um, Amazon. It's called Eva Naturals, but I like it. So anyway, vitamin C is a really big deal. Um, and then if you ever have puffiness under your eyes, I don't know if you've ever heard of Arnica. My mom actually learned about this from her plastic surgeon. She had a couple of facelifts, but anyway, um, the first time she had a facelift, she got Arnica cream. You can also take Arnica under the tongue, but she got this Arnica cream and it helped her heal faster and it takes puffiness out. So you can use a little bit of that under your eyes in the morning. It's great for puffiness. And I don't know if you've ever had a professional facial. I highly recommend them. Love them, love them. I'm actually going for a laser facial tomorrow over at Laser Partners um, in Fayetteville. A little shout out to them. Um, but I love getting regular facials and they always do those glycolic acid peels. And you can do this at home yourself. And so this is a, I got this on Amazon. I think it was less than $20. It's glycolic acid 20% resurfacing pads and they just look like little pads in there. And I just use it like a cleanser over my face. Don't get it too close to your eyes. It kind of stings a little bit. You can rinse it off with cold water if it stings too much. I actually have a much more powerful one, um, but you have to rinse it because it will burn your skin if you leave it on too long. So, but just this one is fine. Um, it doesn't sting my skin too much, so I will just let it sit and dry, and then I'll go ahead and put my nighttime stuff on. So. I don't wash my face in the morning. I just rinse it because I wash it at night. And I use a Estee Lauder skin wash. So I don't know why. It just It's a good one. Um, sometimes I'll just use like a little baby shampoo or something like that too. Because you don't want anything harsh on your skin. And then I'll clean it with this. Um, I will say always, always, always wash your makeup off. Wash it off really well. And... I love just Huggies, and I used to get these little things under my eyes called milia, and they look like little white acne dots under there, and they can get really, really heavy and really diffuse. And so I learned this from an esthetician. She said, just make sure you especially get your under eye makeup off, and they went away, which is super cool. So always, always, always get your makeup off, especially under your eyes, big deal. If you have problems with acne, um, that's really important too, um, to get all the makeup off so it doesn't clog your pores. One thing I love is bio oil. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this before. Um, I get it at Walgreens um, and sometimes on Amazon. It's about the same price, so probably less than $15. Um, it's amazing. It's, um, I should even know, it's a pure selen oil. I don't even know what that is but I absolutely love it. It's good for scars, if you have stretch marks, anything like that. So it is a little bit greasy. Um, so I put it on before my makeup in the morning, so, um, but it can be a little greasy. So, you know, sometimes your makeup slides a little bit, um, but definitely put it on at bedtime. And if you're not around, anybody who cares if you're a little greasy looking, it's, it's really cool. And it won't clog your pores, so you don't have to worry about if you have oily skin. I also like coconut oil. Um, and you would think all that oil would clog your skin, but there's just something about um, the properties in these oils and in coconut oil that have antibacterial properties as well. And so acne formation is um, open pores, hormonal imbalances, and then bacteria get stuck in those pores. So um, pretty much when you have clogged pores, that's because things are, are blocking them. So this actually has some antibacterial properties down in the pores, so that's good. Um, 
stay out of the sun. I've been a sun worshiper my whole life. Um, I am very much into um, the self tanners now. And so I like this two tan to give a damn. I got this at Walgreens probably 12 to $15 probably. I self tan. If I don't tan, people start asking me, are you sick? Do you feel okay? Because <laughs> I'm a really pale girl. Um, but I probably tan once every two weeks or so like that. So, and at least my face and upper body because nobody's seen my legs in the winter time, right? So self tanner is good. Um, along with um, self tanner, there's also a Jergens Natural Glow. This is probably less than $10. And um, this is great, especially for old lady crepey arms, which now I love the, I'm probably gonna butcher it, L'Occitane, <laughs> my new little hand cream that I love, love, love. Um, but it helps with the, um, crepiness and collagen and things like that. So that's that's super cool. Okay, here's a fun little thing. This is the Avorla. This is on Amazon. You can get these. They're a little pricey, probably around $70, but I absolutely love it. We have red light therapy in our office, so we have the big machines. But this is just a small little um, portable machine. It plugs in and it is red light therapy. And you probably have to, I have to hold it down. I don't want to blind you or anything because it's kind of like a little bit of a laser light. But anyway, um, you just turn it on, put a little serum on your face. You can see it right glow in there and just run it over your face. You can sit there and do it while you're watching it TV at night. It's really, it gets a little warm, not hot, but it just feels good. And you can just, you know, do it on your neck, your arms, anywhere that you have any collagen breakdown. The red light therapy goes through the deepest layers or the, the deepest layers of the topical dermis and can regenerate collagen. So this is awesome. I love this little thing. Speaking of collagen, um, I do these grains and I do a collagen supplement every morning because real skin health comes from the inside out. So I will also say that um, in my office, not trying to do a plug for you, come see me. I'm really just trying to share some goodies with you. But I do bioidentical hormones because I'm way past menopause now. So estrogen has a huge effect on skin elasticity and collagen. And really, when you look at anybody who's aging and you see breakdown in skin or elasticity, it's because they're losing um, the estrogen influence of their collagen stimulation and making new collagen. Um, oh, one little thing, I have my little glove here. I use a glove when I use my self tanner and um, this makes all the difference to make it really smooth. So that's good too. Um, I also use a sugar scrub on my face and on my arms to keep my skin um, exfoliated. I really love exfoliation. You can buy expensive ones. I literally make my own and I use the, uh, the brown, not brown sugar, but it's the all natural sugar that's sort of a brown color and it's kind of got the thick granules because that has the best exfoliating. And then I use um, a coconut oil. I put a couple of squirts of lavender and then I think I usually put like a shea butter uh, in there too. Um, I think it's actually a massage oil. I can, you guys can message me if you wanna know exactly what the oil is I put in there. And it's just a really soft little oily texture, but really good for exfoliation. Another little trick that I do is I have a thing of uh, conditioner in my shower. And so when I'm done with my shower, I put conditioner, hair conditioner, all over and it really helps soften everything too. Um, I love the Jergens um, topical skin cream as well as my new L'Occitane stuff. Um, and I'm sorry if I'm butchering that. It's funny because on their website, they actually have all over it the actual pronunciation and how to say it. So um, I, I already forgot how to say that. So anyway, I think that's everything that I really wanted to share with you tonight, but I'll tell you a little story about my mom, my mom's ghost. <laughs> and we always said that when she passed away that we'd have all these little reminders and that she would stay super present in my life. My best friend still is my best friend, um, but she passed away about four years ago and she's very, very active in my life. Almost every other thought is, you know, my mom talking to me. And in fact, it's funny because in my house, all my pictures will end up like crooked and um, the drawers in my den that are Velcroed shut are open almost all the time. It's just crazy. Hey, Christina, <laughs> I'm telling my story. I just saw you today. I'm telling my story about my mom's ghost. Um, so anyway, um, she's always finding ways to talk to me. And 
last Christmas. I was really, really missing her. And I think one of the things I was missing the most was that every Christmas we would, on, we would do our Christmas gifts on Christmas Eve. But every Christmas morning, we would open Christmas stockings and we would open our little presents. And they were the goofiest little things. Like we'd go to the dollar store and just bought, you know, buy like the silliest little things. Um, and the one thing that was always in there was a makeup palette, eyeshadow palette. It was a big thing and I'm such a girly girl. You know, it's just fun to have that kind of stuff. And so anyway, um, I really missed that. And I know she's with me in, in the spirit and she's very, very present in my life all the time. But that physical, just being able to hold them and touch them and the beauty of, you know, just being in the presence of someone physically is so powerful. But anyway, so I was missing her. And my nephew, Jason, if he's watching, hello, baby, um, calls me Christmas morning and he's, you know, doing things with family, with his girlfriend's family and stuff. And he says, um, are you home? And I was like, yeah. And he said, can I come by and bring you something? And I was like, yeah, we don't normally exchange gifts with, you know, our extended family and stuff. So it's just, you know, we tell each other we love each other. We you know, have snacks together, but, um, and then we try to do nice things throughout the year for each other. So there's no pressure about just buying a bunch of gifts for people. So anyway, um, I'm like, yeah. So he comes over and he brings me um, a, a present and it is a Estee Lauder uh, bag kind of box thing with eyeshadow in it. So like, how would my nephew, a guy, a guy guy, um, know to do that, right? And it just oh, brought tears to my eyes. I was just bawling like a baby. So it was just such a beautiful experience. So just kind of carried with me. I'm like, thanks mom, you know, thanks for the eyeshadow, that's cool. So this Christmas, he was with family, um, text me and he said, I have something for you. And I'm like, okay, mom, what are you bringing me today? <laughs> and so anyway, um, it's kind of funny because he ended up getting caught up with um, his girlfriend's family and stuff. So anyway, he said, um, I got something for you, but you know, I'll get it to you later. So um, he comes by my office today and he has my Christmas present. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's an eyeshadow palette, I'm pretty sure. And so anyway, here's the crazy thing. So Michaela, my boyfriend's daughter, got me this makeup milk. And I would just mention it at the early part of this video. You can go back and watch the beginning if you're just coming on now or watch it later. But anyway, it's an under eye uh, primer that holds your makeup on. So here's the crazy thing. Over the past year, I don't know, hormone changes or maybe it's something different. I've been using um, moisturizer under my makeup or something, but or some reaction that's happening in my eyes. I don't know, allergies. I've not been able to wear any mascara. I've gone through, I swear, 10 or 15 different mascaras. And it's also funny because Michaela that got me this recommended a mascara online and it was it was a pretty pricey little mascara and you know swore by it and I thought oh my gosh I, I can't use it raccoon eyes like very next day Halloween I tried to like put eye makeup stuff on and it's just bleeding down my face and so anyway so she got me this and I thought you know what this is primer and she told me you know it's it'll make your makeup stay in place nothing will move and I love it and I, I've been wearing it and I thought oh I'm gonna try to wear some mascara so I put on some mascara this week and it's great. It doesn't move at all. It doesn't bleed. And so anyway, I was like, hey, I can wear any kind of mascara. I was just telling the girls at work that, that, and then not five minutes later, I swear less than five minutes, um, my nephew comes in and he has a gift for me. And I think you can probably guess what the gift was. It was a little gift pack of eye stuff, eye pencil, mascara, so I'm like, talk to my mom today, and she sent me some presents today, so that was really awesome. Um, let's see, what else can I share? I think that's a good start tonight, but those are my skincare things. Um, there's lots of things you can do, lasers, like I mentioned, the IPL lasers, like at Laser Partners. Um, we got some fun things coming to our office very soon. We're gonna have cool sculpting, which is the fat freezing stuff, so I'll do some videos on that and share that stuff with you too. Um, I know I need to talk about supplements and supplements for the skin and things like that, so I can do another video on that. But I just wanted to share some fun stuff with you and uh, maybe you're a little bored tonight and just wanted to delve into some things that you can help with the anti-aging process and with your skin. And you know, beauty is from the inside out and beauty is who you are. 
um, not how you look, but when you look better on the outside and you feel better in your confidence and you're glowing, that's a great thing. I'll also mention that eating healthy makes a big difference and I'm not preaching because I eat junk food, I'll just be honest, but um, there are choices you can make and I did a video the other day talking about my shopping trip for my son and helping him get a little healthier too. Exercise is wonderful, exercise is so important. Oh and I have my ice water here, hydration is super important for the skin. Um, but you know, maybe you make 2022 an amazing year. We've got the masks off now. We can go to the gym now. Um, commit to doing something. And I'm going to do some videos about how um, intermittent eating and intermittent exercise are super powerful with some nerdy science. So there's so many things to think about. But I hope this was a fun little um, visit with me this evening. Okay, I love you guys. I'll see you later. Mwah.